dinner room! Oh my god, it's loading. That's how you know big stuff is happening. I thought we would get a nice cutscene or something. That's it? That's it? A very unceremonious... Entrance? Okay. Hello! Ah, Denerim. If we have time, I would like to look for Marjolaine. We have a score to settle. Don't worry, we do have time. And we'll do this all one by one. There is a chantry. You were very quiet, Stan. Only compared to some. <laughs> You're getting along well. Good day. Good day. This is... what is this? It shall be done. What? Oh... Uh, it was I... Marjolaine's home! Marjolaine's home! What? Oh! Um... I shall do it. Hold up. Hold. Was I? Ah, oh, you were given directions to a house on the western side of Denerim's market district, and Liliana wishes to stop by it if you're ever in the city. I just happened to stumble right upon the house in question. Oh. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Direct me. Oh, dude, what is that attack? War cry? I am uh. ready. Stan. Try not to look too incompetent. It's Gotta do some good work here. Let's end this. Is Liliana automatically flanking? Marjolaine, literally right at your doorstep. As you say, glamour charm. This minor magical charm captures the viewer's attention in this Oh, pretty. <laughs> Is it a gift or what? Liliana, are you ready? Looking for little old me? What do you know of this place? Denerim is Ferelden's most important city, yes? This is the seat of power, the jewel in the crown of the king. She is Ferelden's heart. Her walls are strong, but within them lies so much beauty, just like the country and the people. Looking for little old me? Do you have any thoughts on Marjolaine before we go on? Yes? What's on your mind? No. Nope. Well, here we go. Here we go. It shall be done. Marjolaine's right here. Liliana! Oh, so lovely to see you again, my dear. <laughs> Spare me the pleasantries. I know you're... Oh, you must excuse the shabby accommodations. I try to be a good host, but you see what I have to work with. This country smells like wet dog everywhere. I cannot get the smell out. Even now it is in my hair, my clothes. Ugh. Ferelden doesn't smell like a no. What's she playing at here? We killed your guards outside. Why are you still pretending? Why did you send assassins after Liliana? So businesslike, your companion. You framed me, had me caught. And tortured. I thought that in Ferelden I would be free of you, but it seems I am not. What happened to make you hate me so? Why do you want me dead so badly? Dead? Nonsense. I know you, my Liliana. I know what you are capable of. Four or five men you can dispatch easily. They were sent to give you cause to come to me. And see? Here you are. Wow, sounds like this lady really respects human life. We don't believe you. You are so transparent. What are you up to, Marjolaine? Why are you in Ferelden? In truth, you have knowledge that you can use against me. For my own safety, I cannot let you be. It is you think I did not know where you were? Did you think I would not watch, my Liliana? What is she up to, I thought? The quiet life, the peasant clothes, hair ragged and messy like a boy. Uh, this is not her. You were planning something, I told myself, so I watched. But no letters were sent, no messages, you barely spoke to anyone. Clever, Liliana, very clever. 
You almost had me fooled. But then you left the Chantry so suddenly. What conclusion should I draw? You tell me. You think I left because of you? You think I still have some plan for... for revenge? You are insane. Paranoid. This lady's paranoia is gonna get her killed. I don't get the impression that we're gonna be leaving today without one of these people dead. Liliana or Marjolaine. I don't know how much we want to tell her. It doesn't really matter. She's not gonna give up. Whatever we tell her, she's gonna think we're lying. Not everything is about you, Marjolaine. Oh, is that what you think? If I were you, I would believe nothing she says. Not a one. Oh. She will use you. You look at her and you see a simple girl, a friend, trusting and warm. It is an act. I am not you, Marjolaine. I left because I didn't want to become you. Oh, but you are me. You cannot escape it. No one will understand you the way I do, because we are one and the same. Do you know why you were a master manipulator, Liliana? It is because you enjoyed the game. You reveled in the power it gave you. You cannot change or deny this. She's trying to put me against Liliana here, but if she were the same as you, she would not have been okay with staying in Ferelden and not going back to Orle to kill you, to tie up loose ends, like what you're doing right now to her. So I don't think she's the same as you, even though I do have some reservations about maybe things that she's been keeping from us. For example, in the beginning, we didn't know she was a spy, but she has been slowly opening up to us. So I, I don't think at all that they're the same person, like she's trying to convince me. I trust Liliana, no matter what you say. Thank you. You will not threaten me or my friends again, Marjolin. I want you out of my life forever. Extra sad too, because these two used to be lovers, but you don't really get a sense of that at all here. And that's how much they hate each other now. You know she will hound you as long as she lives. You've caused too much pain for too many, Marjolin. It ends here. And you think you can kill me like that? I made you, Liliana. I can destroy you just as easily. Trap detected. Oh, damn, there's like 20 people here. Hey, can they... Will they get hurt by their own trap? Maybe not. That's a mage. Is she a mage? Um... Yeah, we should probably get rid of that pressure plate immediately. But after that... You know what? Maybe Morgan? Do you want to force field this lady just so she's not bugging us for a bit? Right. And then the rest of you guys... Dude, we should... Okay, we need to get that... Mage, that mage. It's your time to die. Sten. Oh, there's another trap here. Shoot. It shall be as you say. Is this gonna be okay? Say. Oh, come on. Oh, I keep missing. Okay, got a little bit of... That mage has got to go today. Today. Sten! Hold up. You... Actually, Wellens is doing really poorly on the health. Oh, I have a different kind of potion. A greater one. No, I'll just use a... Um, lesser one for now. Liliana, if I leave you here, is it okay? Did she use the dirty fighting? Right, and then you can probably like go back and try to attack him or something, but everyone else out in the front. Oh my god, there is so much happening here. Sten. If I do a sweep. Oh yeah, that was nice. 
Does that work? Stan, you want to heal up a little bit? Wallens is still not doing great. Okay, we gotta hurry up and go. He spent a lot of time in here. The guard is messing with us. Oh, Morgan! Stan! Stan is gone. Morgan is alone outside. That's not good. Not good at all. Did the Cone of Cold work? I couldn't tell. Let me have a think here. I never even tried the revive spell on Wynn. Well, no one else is around here. We could just do like a flame blast or something. Does that work okay? Not the greatest. She needs some potions too. I'm running out of the good potions. As you wish. Oh, she's gone. She's gone. All right, we gotta really deal with this. Liliana! We need to stun some people. Liliana doesn't have the pots either. Are they still getting me from bot like through the wall and stuff? I am ready. Dude, we gotta get this dude here. Yes. Thank you. Just need a little bit more. I shall do it. I suppose violence is I shall do it. Sometimes. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna be okay here. Let's get the the lesser health one. Good, 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 good. It shall be done. Oh, how dare you! How dare you! Bloodthirst. Mm, I'm thinking if I should do bloodthirst so that we can get this over with quicker. It is begun. Captivating song. You should. Oh damn. Here, I positioned you well in the back and all that. Send me. You know what? In some way, this is perfect. Wellens and Liliana. Come on. What is she? Is that the captivating song thing she's doing? She's not moving at all. That all you've got. Don't give them the advantage. She's just not moving at all. Is that normal? I suppose violence is a solution. I can't see her ability, right? So I can't see what she's doing, but she seems to be continually stunning people. I think that's what the thing does, which means I should really focus on attacking and stop pommel striking. Thank God for indomitable. All right, battle it is then. Lady, this is a skill you use when you have people around you. Defend yourself. As you say. Not when you're alone. Don't give them the advantage. Is she dumb? As long as she doesn't snap out of it, I think we're okay. Here comes trouble. I shall do it. Oh, I'm really noticing my missing this time. I keep missing. Yeah, Liliana repeatedly getting stunned, but it's not like a big deal. We have done well. Liliana. It's over. She's dead. She's dead because of me. I... I need some time to myself. We... will talk later. That was kind of insane how it was down to me and Liliana and then... She was captivating... or she was casting that captivating song spell for like 20 million years. Ooh, I wish she had a good bit of gold on her. Could that have turned out another way? I... I instinctively want to say no. But I'm not sure. Because were you really just going to leave her? Would you really have? That seems incredibly, incredibly dangerous. It's no fair. How come when... How come when the enemies step over their own traps, they don't get hurt? Marjolaine's Recurve. Dragonthorn. 
manuscript copy. Antiven. The title is Antiven, or maybe Navarin, syllable, but not uniquely noteworthy. Do you really not want to talk? Looking for little old me? Yes? What's on your mind? Okay. She still talks all the same, but she needs time to process what happened. I await your command. Do you not know the- oh, of course you don't know anything about places. You've never been outside the wilds. So, full of questions, are you? <laughs> you called. I am hardly surprised. We're okay for now. Very well. As you wish. Okay, well, Liliana, just have a think. Have a think. Could that have gone another way? Oh, it's finished. Marjolaine could not be allowed to hound Liliana, so you killed her. I think it's always going to be upsetting. We don't know Marjolaine very well, but Liliana did very, very well at one point, and having to kill someone like that is just never going to feel that great. But at the same time, Marjolaine was very readily okay with killing Liliana, so I don't think she should feel too bad. Oh my god, this, this bow is amazing, but not yet. 34 decks. But the Bregan's bow has plus 6 attack. Oh, attack is the, the rate though, not damage. Hmm. Keep it in mind for now. No, nope. Sten, what about your sword? Sorry guys, crushed arm. Bleeding. Oh my god, maybe we should go back to the camp already. Especially since we did just finish Liliana's quest. Hey, maybe she wants to take a bit of a break. Because, yeah, she needs a break. God knows she needs one. Well, I thought they were going to be more hidden, but they were literally the first house we came upon in the entire Denarum. Which, uh, hopefully no one saw what happened here. Hello. Good day. Okay, well, cool. Men are the work of our maker's hands, from the lowest slaves to the highest kings. Those who bring ham without provocation to the least of his children are breaded and accursed by the maker. Those who bring ham? <laughs> and the maker does not bread sinners. Oh, would you stop correcting me? <laughs> I know the chant like the back of my hand. I was wondering how come that sounded As a little bit there weird. Is but one world, one life, one death. There is but one God, and he is our maker. They are sinners who have given their love to false gods. What, no mention of dessert? Surely this is a miracle. <laughs> Don't be mean. The one who repents, who has faith unshaken by the darkness of the world, and roasts not, nor gloats over the misfortunes of the weak, but takes delight in the Maker's law and creations. Boasts. It's boasts, sister, not roasts. She shall know the peas of the Maker's benediction. The light shall lead her safely through the paths of this world and into the next. Peace, sister, peace. She shall know the peace of the Maker's benediction. The veal holds no uncertainty for her, and she will know no fear of death, for the Maker shall be her bacon and her shield, her foundation and her... There's no veal in the chant. You're doing this on purpose, aren't you? <laughs> they all happen to be food-themed, too. Hmm, very suspicious. If the Maker heard this chant, chanted throughout the lands of Ferelden, would he be touched by your sincerity? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I liked her version of the chant better. Oh, hello, dear. Can we help you? Um, what she means is, in Andraste's name, be welcome. Stop correcting me! What would Andraste do? That's what you should be concerned with, I say. Andraste was no fuss budget. <laughs> what are you doing? Praying for the good people of Denerim who've lost loved ones at Ostagar. 
It's usual to recite a stanza from Transfigurations when you pray for the departed. It's usual to recite the stanza correctly. But that's what I said. <laughs> Can you tell me about the chant? Tell you about the chant? What? As if it's a cake you might buy? Well, it's done enough, but a little too much nutmeg for my taste. Sister, instructing the ignorant is a sacred duty of the chantry. <laughs> Fine, then. What do you want to know? What was that verse you were reciting just now? It's the tenth stanza from the Transfigurations. Lovely canticle, that one. Oh, you should have heard Brother Cademan sing it, though. He sang it well, I take it. He had a voice like a bucket full of toads. Revered Mother Boan, bless her heart, always said, if we had more voices like his, the Maker couldn't fail to take note of us. I wasn't aware that toads were known for good singing, but okay. What happened to him? It was tragic, really. Such a surprise. We don't speak of that. Oh. He died? He was in charge of the Lyrium storehouse. It wasn't good for him, you see. He took off all his clothes in the middle of the chart one summer day and ran into the street. He tripped and fell into the vat of elderberry wine for the feast and drowned. We were six days drying him out for his cremation. He looked like a pickled egg. So tragic. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Mm, I thought when you said lyrium, I thought he was gonna be addicted to lyrium too, but Well, it was it sounds like a, a series of unfortunate events What does the chant say about Darkspawn? Oh, there are some very stirring canticles about doom and wrath Darkspawn were created by mankind's second sin pride Arrogance became a great caged beast in the lands of Tevinter, an emptiness that consumed all and could never be filled. To satisfy its hunger, the mage lords assaulted the Golden City, heart of all creation, to take the Maker's power for themselves. Why does no one ever sing the good stanzas during Chantry services anymore? They speak them. It's called the Chant of Light, not the Speech of Light. Sister... Would you kindly stop messing up the chant? See how you like being interrupted. Well, you get the general idea, I'm sure. I actually haven't heard a single person chant or sing the chant. It's always been just a speech. Ah, so the Devinter Imperium Mages, when they went to the Golden City, it wasn't with the... It wasn't for sightseeing. They went with the intent of taking the Maker's power for themselves. That's the, the ultimate sin here. It is almost mealtime, isn't it? Um, uh, blessings of the Maker and of Andraste, his bride, upon you. Oh, the chant of light. Redemption. Many are those who wander in sin, despairing that they are lost forever. But the one who repents, who has faith unshaken by the darkness of the world, and boasts not, nor gloats over the misfortunes of the weak, but takes delight in the Maker's law and creations, she shall know the peace of the Maker's benediction. Oh, that's the one that they were saying. The light shall lead her safely through the paths of this world and into the next. For she who trusts in the Maker, fire is her water. As a moth sees light and goes toward flame, she should see fire and go towards light. The veil holds no uncertainty for her, and she will know no fear of death. For the Maker shall be her beacon and her shield, her foundation and her sword. Didn't you have a little bit more? No time for chat, dear. It's meal time. Sister, that's hardly polite. <laughs> it's true, though, isn't it? Doesn't the chant say, you may not lie, for there is only one truth? <laughs> I should leave you to your work. Um, uh, blessings of the Maker and of Andraste, his bride, upon you. I hope that cheered up Liliana a little bit, too. People receiving chants? What are you guys... Pumpkins! Pumpkins. Magic exists to serve man and never to rule over him. Foul and corrupt are they who have taken his gift and turned it against his children. They shall be named Malefica, accursed ones. We read they this shall one. Find no rest in this world or beyond. I was getting to that part. <laughs> she really does like interrupting her. 
And after much sweat, blood and toil, her labors ended, and the world marveled at what she wrought. I think that's for the conscripts. Yes. The deep dark before dawn's first light seems eternal, but know that the sun always rises. Hmm. Now we get some new ones. Back alley justice. Eliminate criminals preying on innocent folk in Denerim's back alleys. In these dark times, we must work together against the common threat. Sergeant Kylan has brought disturbing news that should anger all righteous people. In our own alleyways, footpads, muggers, and miscreants lie in wait to profit from the chaos of our times. They infect us like a plague. A reward is available for any information on these low lives. Sergeant Kylan has also offered a heavy purse for any brave souls that can best these brigands and make Denerim a safe place once again. Okay. Missing in action. Find Rexel. Recently, our hearts were lifted when many survivors of the Battle of Osagar returned to us. Makers bless these men and women and have mercy on those who fell defending our children from the Blight. Sadly, one of these heroes has gone missing. Rexel served in Terran Loghain's vanguard with distinction. But they didn't even fight! They didn't even fight, but he went missing? Upon his return, his wife said he was prone to quiet reflection and frequented the local taverns. One afternoon, he left his home and never returned. Hmm, maybe some kind of war trauma. I mean, yeah, they didn't fight, but it's still traumatic to see so many people die, especially the king. This chanter was moved by the family's grief and is offering a pouch of coin for anyone who finds the hero. The chant says, in saving one man, you save us all. For if each of us lends a hand to aid his neighbor, anything is possible, especially now. Okay. Fazl's request. Find his sextant. Master Fazl of the esteemed Guild of Free Sailors has informed this chanter that while, guild, while about guild business, he was waylaid by bandits via guile and other chicanery. He lost many valuables, in particular, antique sextant which has considerable symbolic value as it belonged to the first guild master. He said that his assailants were of foreign descent, perhaps the winter of free marches, and they're unusually coordinated and crafty. Hmm, maybe they aim for him on purpose. Loghain's push. Brothers and sisters, word has arrived of an imminent conflict. Terran Loghain's honored forces continue to root out threats to our nation, and in their actions deserve support from the common people. While it is unusual to post troop movements to the public board, I believe it is necessary for brethren near the affected area to respect the honored Terran by aiding his troops. Provide whatever comfort you feel they deserve, and Ferelden will be stronger for it. Um... I don't know, man. These people might be too close to Logan for me to really go there. We are supposed to be wanted right now. I know it's easy to forget, but we are wanted. <laughs> As there is but one world, one life, one death, there is but one God, and He is our Maker. They are sinners who have given their love to false gods. What well, is strange that matters can be so tumultuous and yet the day still be so bright? Oh, my pardon. Just thinking aloud. <laughs> are you here for the Chanter's board? Ah, lady, do you need help? I'll do it, because I do everything for everyone. Who are you? I am Sister Justine, curator of the reliquary of this Chantry. <laughs> Pride again. <laughs> it is hard to live up to the example of Andraste. What's a curator do? The archivist tends the books and I tend the sacred relics. I also search for more to add to our collection, which is more difficult than it sounds. Because your collection is so complete? There are still relics to be found after all these years? My thought exactly, but I'm perpetually amazed at how quickly people accept fantastic claims at face value. A hawker on the street will claim to have an actual finger bone of Andraste. In this city alone, you could make the skeleton of ten prophets from fingers alone. <laughs> what about urns? Curators often accept them as genuine. I worry about the authenticity of even our most holy artifacts. Well, as long as people believe in it, does it really matter if it's real? Could you look at our urn once we find it? How do we know that's really the ashes of Andraste? How difficult is it to verify a relic? When I was a curator of a much smaller chantry in Orlais, I thought that false relics slipped through because of laziness. But the life of the cloth is never an easy one, and that explanation always seemed hollow to me. Now I believe it's the seduction of the divine. 
We all want a personal connection to the Maker. We want to believe that what we hold in our hands is the actual sandal that slipped from Andraste's foot before the fires consumed her. Faith is of the heart, not of the head. When the heart is ungoverned by reason, charlatans have powerful tools to deceive. People just want something to believe in, something to um, anchor themselves to in this world. Balancing faith and reason is difficult, though. And often close to heretical. But I believe that the truth only increases the awe of the Maker and his prophet, not demean it. Even false symbols have the power to inspire. But it seems every year we fall more out of touch with the real Andraste. Do you think the Urn of Sacred Ashes is real? Certainly. My research indicates that all of the ashes were gathered into a pot or urn. But it's been lost for centuries. That doesn't stop hawkers from selling pinches of the ashes of Andraste to gullible pilgrims. The real ashes may still be hidden somewhere, though it's possible the urn broke. But Andraste ultimately was human. I don't know how many magical powers, even if we do find it, is that going to have. If you tell me it's the, the ashes of the Maker... Whoa, is that like blasphemy? I just basically said the Maker is dead. Whoops. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. She's human. Or she was human. How many real relics have you found? Well, there's one that might be real. I couldn't prove it wasn't. Perhaps you can understand my skepticism. So many claims, so few truths. Could you tell me about your job? You've shown admirable patience listening to my diatribe before. I will not bore you again. <laughs> Suffice it to say, I look for and authenticate holy relics for the Chantry. Okay, well, thank you for, you know, telling me about yourself. Gotta go. Farewell. Of course. Enjoy your visit to the Chantry. Yeah, she seems pretty in touch with reality of things and all that. Even false symbols can give power. She's right. In the name of Andraste, Bride of the Maker, be welcome in this house. While the cathedral is closed, if you need to make wedding or funeral arrangements, you'll have to talk to Sister Oma. Did someone die? I remember a funeral. King Kaelin died, remember? Along with most of the army at Ostagar? Maker guide them all. That guy doesn't know the king died? Is he okay? Isn't that like big news? Why is the cathedral closed? That which you fear, living in the shadow of death alone, I have seen it is only a cloud passing before the sun. The death toll at Ostagar was staggering. We've had a funeral every day for a lost son or daughter of Denerim, and we've many more yet to hold. What's wrong with your friend? Are they singing the chant now? It's a funeral, isn't it? He should have retired to Valroyo years ago, but he wanted to stay and serve the remainder of his days in his homeland. It's the lyrium that does this. The lyrium addiction? Is he even fit enough to continue doing whatever he's doing? I know you're all just standing in front of a cathedral, but... Lyrium did this to him? Why doesn't he stop taking it? He wouldn't be a Templar anymore. Blessed are they who stand before the corrupt and the wicked, and do not falter. He doesn't forget who he is, even if he can't remember anything else. I'm not sure if that's a good or bad thing. I'll come back later. May the light of the Maker guide your steps. So that's introducing the Lyrium addiction via an actual scene as opposed to reading about it in the Codex. I think the last time we heard about it without reading about the Codex was when Alistair talked about it. It doesn't come up very often. Magic exists to serve man and never to rule yes, yes. over him. Yes, yes. taken his gift and turned it It's a big place. Against his children. They shall be named Malefica, accursed ones. Let's just they keep walking around them. the outer edges. See if we can find stuff. Why are you in this little corner here like you're not supposed to be here? Good to see you again. More stuff! Blood of Warning. While they tend to be careful and judicious in their use of force, the Templars do indeed make mistakes. 
I understand that several relatives of our friends among the collective will soon become targets of the Chantry, and while I trust that this will not lead to lasting harm for those innocents, I wish to ensure that those targeted are fairly warned and evacuated before the Chantry can send in its message. I ask that a noble soul take the bundle of vials attached to this missive and find the four homes the Chantry is likely to target in Denerim. Mark the front door of each home with a goat's blood from the vials. Those relatives will understand the message and evacuate before the Chantry can threaten them. Okay. Is it okay? We're doing stuff for the Chantry and we're also doing stuff for the Collective. Have you seen me? The Collective is saddened at the absence of the great mage, Reynold. Our friend has not been seen in quite some time, and our gatherings are the lesser for the loss of his tales of ribald exploits and the aroma of his delicious twice-baked meat pies. Reynold was last seen traveling in the direction of the Brazilian forest. We should go there sometime. Oh, how he did so love the outdoors. Anyone who returns with the evidence of the whereabouts of the beloved mage, Reynold will be rewarded. I think we have some conscriptions and people to look for for the Blackstone Irregulars and Denerim as well. A place of a lot of happenings. I just remembered. I was gonna give Liliana a break because she needs to rest, but... Chests. <laughs> I need you for chests. Because Zevran is garbage. He's not reliable. Hooded Courier. Hello? My client appreciates your generosity. What? Uh... Uh, okay! That must have been one of the quests that... I don't, I don't even know which quest that was. It didn't say quest updated. So I, I don't know what that was. Sure. Sergeant Kylan. We have a... Whoa, what's going on here? Like a Those circus? Are too small. Send them back to the priests for more training. Hey, it's not about your size. It's about how you use it. Door of a blood mage's relative. Oh yeah, these are all openable. Hold up. So that's what we just picked up. Knight Commander. Goat's blood. Don't we need a mage for this? I know how to apply it. Turn your attention elsewhere. My business does not concern you. Of course. Thank you and farewell. <laughs> okay. Mysterious door. Can we open those chests? Are people gonna get mad? Should I try stealing from random people? So many things I wanna do. Don't even know where to start. I could do that for you. Mm -hmm. oh. Liliana, if you get arrested here, it's not my fault, okay? Hey, this is this is good for you. Liliana. Yes. Oh my god, people are just walking around. Morgan's been bleeding the whole time still. Sten. Sten and his crushed arm. Maybe I should let people have a rest back at the camp. I don't know though. Yes, Maybe not Liliana. I shall. Oh. Yeah, I don't think these people would be happy with me. Dwarven crafts. Find dwarven crafts. Direct from Orzammar. You won't find better. Sir Landry. Hey, is that an urn guy? Sir, something kind of reminds me. We have much to do. Maybe. Dwarven crafts. Find dwarven crafts. Direct from Orzammar. You won't find better. Hello. Welcome. Welcome. We sell only the strongest dwarven steel, folded over a hundred times in the forges of Orzammar. In times like this, surely your group could use some extra protection on the road. I'd rather buy information if you've got any to sell. I'll answer what I can, but my policy is not to sell things that don't belong to me. What's happening in the city right now? The lands meets the big news. Every dusty noble estate in Denerim is airing its sheets, waiting for the Lord to ride into town. Lands meet. Lands meet? Is that like when the rulers of all the lands come together? Who are some important people in Denerim? It's the capital of Ferelden, so naturally the queen and regent are at the top. 
But the man who seems to be running the city guard is the new Arl Rendon Howe. <gasps> came in from somewhere up north. <sighs> hmm. Let me see what's in your store now. Every piece comes with a stamp of assurance from my wife's father, the best smith in Denerim. Your wife's father, huh? Gorm sword. I think we're fine. Yeah, these aren't like super crazy off the top of my head. Metal shards for traps. I still haven't tried making a trap. Still barely tried using the poison making and stuff. Yeah, okay, well, thank you, but no thank you for now. Do I have anything for you? I could probably sell all this stuff. I just don't... Yeah, actually, we haven't done too much since the last time I looked around anyway. This is... this is okay. This is okay. Dragon Thorn. That's gotta be a Liliana thing. 